Hmm, quite a nice boggy place. Hmm. And the beautiful, uh, this semi-aquatic uh, grass is there. This one. It grows uh, in shallow waters and stream sides. Mm, very soft clay. I keep my foot, it goes in here. How sticky it is. Huh? I'm going to go to Itto, all the ones are cut cut. No, no, I can't. No, no. This is one level area. The water flow is quite slow. But not deep also. A lot of sand is there on the sides. The silt and all. This is how the streams look when there is no interference, no disturbance. That is, canop, full canopy is there. So, not much sunlight will fall. And then, uh, it's never straight. All these twists and turns that the stream takes, that allows uh, the water to slow down and uh, sedimentation to fall. So to settle down to the base. Nice clear water but no fish. Sometimes these uh, this clear water also can be deceptive because upstream if there is some uh, some chemical or other they throw into the water it uh, suddenly kills off everything so you can't make out if there's the fertilizer used ah, this is a nice place some of these mossy rocks are very beautiful Now I am teaching myself this uh, stream ecology by looking up in YouTube and all and then uh, observing in actual life what they are describing there and then some of that whatever I am learning I am observing in real life and then uh, doing some of these videos so that uh, people can uh, know I mean those who can't uh, go to out and say three and all at least they can get some inkling uh, here once again it's slow wherever it's slow the sedimentation happens and uh, it's full of roots actually 
almost few inches of sandy stuff is there. Wherever it, uh, the gradient is there and the flow increases like here, there will be no sand and all, it will be more hard uh, stones and the depth also is less because the faster flow exposes the rocks and that also speeds up the water flow. Quite a nice cotton lamp at the border of somebody's palm finally. So, this water starts at the edge of uh, one paddy field and then flows through this small section. And then uh, crosses the road on the other side. And finally, it continues as a stream for a little more and enters the next paddy field. So, the from one level area, when there is a drop in the altitude, the water speeds up and then uh, the tiny one surface uh, makes it... Uh, inappropriate for farming so they will leave it like this and then some rocks and all get exposed and then it goes down and settles at the next level area that is the next uh, wherever there is level and little valley bottom they uh, paddy cultivation is happening so this is a nice uh, feature of these streams. Wherever there is a little level, the valley is formed. And wherever the there is a drop in the height, the water speeds up and then uh, unsuitable for agriculture, those places. Those areas have been left. So I think we got a general look of this place.